Hi, I'm Heert. Um, some people asked me some questions about uh, how I did the uh, tests with the uh, Coca-Cola bottle, uh, the reactor. And um, I'm going to show you uh, what I uh, did to get a coating. Uh, we think that it's uh, SP2, SP3. Uh, graphene, but we are not sure. Okay, now uh, what I do, take a, I take a bottle, uh, pet, pet uh, plastic, and uh, I uh, use the top as a feature. I take I take uh, copper wire. Copper has to be uh, clean. Okay. Put it through the top like this. Okay. Put some silicone on it. And I add a little bit uh, of KOA solution. Um, that's 10% uh, of uh, KOH. That's KOH, but uh, be careful. Don't uh, mix it in this bottle. Um, you better uh, look for some information how you do that. There are several uh, websites who explain. Then, when I have a little bit KOH solution. I don't add Coca Cola or something, just KOH 10% solution. Um, okay, when you put two of these copper wires in it, uh, you after uh, an hour or so, you get uh, some uh, voltages. Okay, um, and I let it for um, two days, two days, two nights, and after that time it uh, always be coated like that. Okay. Okay, that's another one. Okay. Now when um, when I put those three through on top of it show you a little bit closer okay like this okay now camera Set it on resistance. That's one half second. Lay them on top of each other. I don't get a measurement. See? And they are on top of each other, they don't have a measurement. It works, see? Okay, now when I take some um, water, and that's a demineralized, demineralized water, and I take um, a coated a coated uh, wire, copper wire, put it in the water and I take a normal clean copper wire, put it in the water, okay, and I have measurements um, 
12 degrees till uh, around uh, 35. Fill stabilize uh, 35 uh, millivolt. Okay. Take a while. Okay. Um, uh, I will wait uh, a little bit uh, in between. I can uh, explain uh, something to you. Okay. Yeah, like this. You've seen the uh, frame of the reactor uh, in the last uh, video, but um, I still have uh, a problem uh, because um, the, I, I still don't have a, a rotative uh, feed-through, vacuum feed-through. Um, I think uh, everyone uh, gonna have this uh, problem. Uh, it has to be compact, but um, uh, when you see uh, those uh, features on the websites, uh, they are uh, very expensive. I made uh, myself a uh, feature with a ferrofluid. Um, I get uh, till 75% uh, of the vacuum uh, up to 250 millibar, but uh, no more. So that's uh, not enough. I have um, other, another concept uh, that I'm going to test, but I don't have the parts uh, yet for it. Um, I have also the uh, half spheres for the uh, inner core, but I still uh, wait for uh, more uh, information uh, about the uh, um, Polish uh, reactor. Okay, now um, I think it's almost stable now. I'm going to show you okay. Okay. okay, yeah. Let's see, it's uh, about forty nine, it's still decreasing. Okay. I'm going to take uh, some light away and uh, we're going to see what it's doing. That's okay. Still decreasing. I don't know if you see the measurement of this. Okay, forty-one, forty-one point five. Okay, let's still go. It's going to stabilize on uh, thirty-five. Uh, millivolt. 
Okay. Now I have a black light ring here. When I uh, give some uh, UV light, uh, like sunlight or something, the uh, voltage uh, goes up. Okay. Um, I think it's uh, ionization um, of the water of the hydrogen and the water with the graphene. Okay. Uh, like that. 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, put some light on too, 64, 65, that's why I think it's uh, graphene. When you uh, use two copper wires, that uh, won't go uh, like this. That's why I think it's uh, graphene. That's the only proof we got. It's 68 now. Let's go to 70. Okay, turn it off and decreasing again. See? Okay. was helpful this uh, video um, I have uh, I get uh, so many questions about it and people ask me uh, how you do it and uh, that things um, now I think that uh, this will do and uh, if you have still questions can uh, mail me. Okay? Bye.